hello again uh, thank you so much for tuning into this video uh, we are still on paper 7a and we're gonna be doing the second part of it so this is part b uh, i have already done paper 1 to what to 7 to 14 a uh, question 1 to 14 now we're going to be looking at 15 to what 25 now um i understand you might need this paper for your own personal revision or you want to download it into your own pc or phone so that you can revise it more and more so i will leave a link of this paper in the description below so that you can go through it um so that you can download it and go through it now thank you so much for watching now let's go let's go through each questions and they will discuss the answers with you now number 15 it says this sign regulate that now let's look at the sign so probably uh, in that uh, that uh, re uh, rectangle we have a bicycle and a stop sign so when you have a stop sign on it means that the stop sign is speaking to what to the motorist but when you have a stop sign and a cyclist it means that this stop sign is what is point is speaking to the what to the cyclist so whatever the stop sign is saying it is directed to the, to the cyclist so let's look at our answers vehicle should should give right of way to cyclists not vehicles it's directed to what to cyclists so a is wrong stop and give way to cyclists from those side from the right now c cyclist should stop and give way to crossing traffic so the answer right there is c number 16 before driving a motor vehicle on public road it must leave the following document so before a motor vehicle is driven on the road it should have a registration book vehicle insurance and vehicle license so the correct answer number 16 is a is b a registration book insurance and vehicle license now number 17 when 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 oncoming vehicle lights are on bright beam what do you do yes so a says you pull down the what the sun visor b switch on your lights C, slow down and cast your eyes slightly to the left so it, it is what it is C. you slow down and you cast your eyes slightly to the left now number 18 what are the di what are the direction given by a fixed or by a fixed or flashing ember robot at the intersection when the robot is fixed or flashing it means that we have a fault work system so at this point you are So at this point, you should what you should apply the normal uh, what smuggling rules. So what does it say? It says that a give precedent to all crossing traffic. B a give precedent to vehicles from your right. C give web, give precedent to vehicles from your left. So you give precedent to vehicles from your right. Number that's number eighteen. So number eighteen, the answer is what? It's B. Number nine nineteen. This sign is a so this sign is a D restriction sign. Uh, it it cancels out the pre-imposed speed limits. So so this sign this is the only sign in the what in the um, informative sign that is not right right channel but is what is a is circle. So this is an informative sign. It's informing you that the speed that was imposed previously has not been what cancelled. So this is an informative sign. Take note of that this is the only informative sign that is not rectangle. Right rectangular. Right yes, rectangular. Right now let's look at number um, 20. Which car goes first? Now we have we are looking for the car that goes first, right? Yes. Now let's start with car A. Car A gives right of way to car B. Car B gives right of way to car C. So car C is definitely the one that what that will go first. So our correct answer number 20 is A. Now this sign is A. Now let's look at the sign. Now when you see a triangle right there, it is warning you of a one of something. And you can even see that there is a what? There is a pothole in the in the road. Or can we say a bump? So this sign is a what? Is a danger warning sign. So for number twenty one, it is C. Number twenty two. This sign. Which sign is this? So like I told you from number nineteen, right? This sign is a D restriction sign. So for number 22, it is what? It is A. Number 23, this sign is a, 
Now let's look at this. Uh, for for circles, uh, circles usually uh, what they, they tell us of my of regulatory signs, right? So, um, so let's look at our answers. A says danger warning. B says a one way sign. C says direction sign. So what we need to do here, you need to understand that the what the circle is a what is a regulator. So probably it is regulating something. What is it? It is showing you what a direction. It is showing you what direction. So this is not a direction sign. A direction sign is an informative sign. An informative sign it shows you what the the, the way. So it is not regulating anything, it's just informing you of the way. So it is not a direction sign. B, a one-way sign. Yes, that's a regulator. We are regulating that this way goes what? This road goes what? This way. It does not what? Go the other way. So a one-way sign. So for number 23, the answer is B. It's not A because it is not a right angle. A what? A triangle. A triangle. That the, a triangle, a danger warning sign is shown by what? A triangle. So number 24, the road ahead is A. Now let's look at the what. So most people will probably think that this is a what? A T junction. But no, this is not a T junction. Now let's look at our answers. A, you say it's giveaway sign. Is this a giveaway sign? No, it's not a giveaway sign. Now num let's look at B, a junction road. Okay, C is a right junction. Now, in probably this is warning you of a side road, right? A side road. So, when you see a sign like this, it is a warning of a side road. It's a side road that is coming. So, probably it says that a right junction. Yes, so the junction is to the right. So, the number 24, it is what? It is C. Which car goes second? Let's look at the cars. This is the diagram. We have car A and car B. Which car goes second? Now we can see that car A gives right of way to car B. Because car B is on the right to car C. It's on the right to car A. Car B is on the right to car A. Yes. So which car goes second? The car that goes second is A. Because it gives the right of way to car B. And car B is the one that to enter the intersection first. So the car A. So our answer is what is B. Uh, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you have enjoyed it and I hope you have learned a lot from this video. Uh, now, please subscribe to this channel and if you like these papers, I'll leave a link to them in the description below so that you can go and download them from yourself. Now, thank you again. This is was Paper 7A. Uh, we'll meet again in the next video when I'll do, and when I'll do with you, I'll discuss with you another question paper. Thank you. Goodbye.